Glory to Jesus Christ. Dear brothers and sisters, I want to speak to you today about upcoming elections this Tuesday. It is very important that you utilize your right to vote and the church calls for citizens to participate in their civic duties. However, this participation must always be in line with Christian and Catholic values and morality. This means that you cannot separate your political and civic principles from Catholic principle. How is this practically played out, especially when it comes to voting? You must apply Catholic principles to issues that are not negotiable and vote for a candidate who best upholds these issues. The most important issue that is not negotiable is the respect of human life. And I stand with my brother's bishop and the church in upholding this. The first and foremost way that human life is disrespected in the United States today is through abortion and euthanasia. And therefore, this is the most important issue to vote on today in the United States. At one time, abortion was not legal in the United States. And instead, the greatest way that innocent human life was disrespected was by slavery and racial discrimination. But since the time in history, the United States has outlawed slavery and racial discrimination and instead legalized the killing of an innocent baby in its mother's womb. We have laws uh, in place that say abortion and euthanasia are allowed, but these actions always destroy innocent human life and are never good or allowed according to the Catholic Church. Therefore, if you have two candidates where one wishes to continue the legalization of abortion and euthanasia and the other does not, you are morally obligated to vote for the one who does not support the legalization. By voting for a candidate who openly promotes abortion and euthanasia, you become corresponsible of this sin and crime. There are other issues that are important as well when it comes to voting this election, not just the issues of abortion and euthanasia. And I encourage you to view our in-depth voters guide that we have posted on our website, parma.org. To know these issues and the principles by which they should be applied. But please remember, the most important are the issues of abortion and euthanasia. And therefore, I bring this to your attention out of care for your souls and for your eternal salvation and the salvation of all people in these United States. Many of you have never heard that your politics must be governed by your Catholic faith. And I'm sincerely sorrowed that greater clarity and care was not given to you, informing you in this matter. But Jesus Christ always calls each of us to repentance. And as he has conquered that, he will strengthen us to oppose a culture of death in our country and work to build a culture of life.